Hi, this is Jim Whitley from the world famous tool shed located at 1073 Main Street in Worcester. Hours this week are Wednesday through Saturday, 1 to 5. Uh, all the information can always be found on the website at www.use-tools.com. And let's see, disclaimer, all the videos are as, I mean, all the uh, prices are what they are in the store as opposed to whatever the hell I might say. Usually I'm pretty accurate, but sometimes I'm wrong. Um, all right, so let's start at the beginning. We have the Craftsman Table Saw. That is uh, $80. Oh, I may do a second video this week, um, probably by Thursday night if I'm going to do one, and because uh, I have a whole lot of stuff to still go through. Pliers. I've got a whole bunch of pliers. Most of, A lot of the little guys like this for a buck. Non-vice grip, vice grip, three bucks. The impact driver is $10 if I could open it with one hand, which I can't. It's all in there. $17.50 on the little husky ladder. Uh, pruners, four bucks. Uh, uh, OTC uh, pullers, that's $9. The jack there, that is $45. It's got a sister over here, which is $40 or $45 also underneath that one inch belt and uh, disc sander from Craftsman, which is $50. Bench grinders. We got $10 little guy up front, $80 two speed grinder in the back. The uh, old Craftsman grinder is $50. There is, may as well finish all the grinders at once. There is another grinder over here, which is $17.50. Going back, oh, uh, sorry, I'm just seeing stuff that I put out last week and as I'm going along here. The uh, electric chainsaw is $10. Oh, I forgot about those DeWalt tools. Those were put out last week. Battery, $10. Battery, $20. Bucks. The drill, of course, the all-important numbers that you need to know what it is. DC, D777, that is $50. And the driver is a DCF885, that is $50. Bucks. Uh, the work platform is $20. The motorcycle jack is $45. The three-ton hoist is... $175. Drill press is coming out my ears. $50 on the Craftsman. This guy just came in last week. This is $125. Um, the Delta back there, the 12 inch Delta, is $175. The big Craftsman over here is $200. I think I've been saying $225 for a while, and it's been $200. I don't know why I've been saying $225. Uh, $10 on each of the uh, drill press vices. Another drill press back there, $20. Ladder, $55. Um, $20 on the sawhorses. The yellow fold-out sawhorses are $40 per pair. Makita um, compressor is $200. The little compressor here from the harbor is $22.50. The Porta Cable Compressor is $50. The Rigid Compressor is $125, I believe. Uh, $17.50 on that chain wrench. All right, let's just keep on moving. Let me get to some newer stuff. I have a box of electrical supplies, wire nuts, and all types of stuff. I I'm, really don't want to sort it out. It's 10 bucks for the entire box and its contents. $40 on the start, uh, $268, see if I can zoom in on that, $268, I believe it's a match set of V-blocks with the clamp, uh, $3 on the little fold-out razor knife, uh, $2 on the magnet, $1.50 on this guy, $13.50 on the screw pitch gauge, pitches 4 to 84 from the uh, American, I don't know. Uh, products engineering company um what i say that was 13 dollars and 50 cents uh vice grips eight dollars three dollars five dollars stanley bullnose plane is 25 dollars four dollars on the uh wire or the uh drill drill gauge template chainsaws 200 for the guy on the right 225 for the guy on the left the milwaukee hacksaw with the m12 battery and this is all that it is there's no no charger or anything else that is fifty dollars ryobi um brad nailer with battery and charger 
that is $70. Uh, $20 on all the bits you could ever want. I see Milwaukee Shockwaves in there, DeWalt ones. There's a whole bunch of uh, good stuff in there. 20 bucks for the whole box. Oh, just sorry, looking around. Engine hoist, that is $85. The uh, battery charger is $25. Craftsman box down there is $15. All right, let's start. Wire wheel, eight inch, $350. Eight inch, $6. Six inch, $3. Six inch, $4. $3 on the square, $4 on the SAE uh, quarter inch drive, deep set, no no real name on that, $11.50 on the tack hammer. Sears, oh, I'm, yeah, Sears uh, hand plane, looks like a number four, is $13.50. Craftsman tap and die set is $10. The bargain table, which uh, loaded up with some really interesting stuff this week, is $6. Of course, it's covered by all of my other stuff. Um, the Sonin, Sonin guideline level, that's $8. Craftsman, one battery charger, oscillating tool, that is 60 bucks. Uh, Pittsburgh uh, pry tool is $2.50. $2 on the tape measure. Another tape measure under here somewhere. Uh, Pittsburgh uh, Allen key set. No, that's, I'm sorry, that's a Torx set. That is dollar fifty. Allen key set dollar fifty. British tools. Um, there's a joke in there somewhere. I'm not gonna do it though. Six six dollars on these uh, on this guy here. Two dollars. These are Whitworth. Two dollars on the Whitworth. Two dollars on the Whitworth. Two dollars on the Whitworth. No uh, no name that I recognize on those. Uh, tape measures three dollars. Tape measure two dollars and fifty cents. The square is five bucks. These are Whitworth also. Uh, British Standard Whitworth. I don't know what the hell they are. There's something thirteen dollars and fifty cents for that little set of five. This is a set of Snap-on British sockets. This is seventy-five dollars for the. I think there's fourteen of them there. Seventy-five dollars on all those guys. More snap-on tools. The quarter-inch driver is ten bucks. The ratcheting tool is twenty dollars. Snap-on stubby. This is British, also. That's ten bucks. That's uh, five sixteenths British. Put that with the Brits. Five dollars on this little guy, and this little guy here is uh, seven dollars and fifty cents from Snap-on. And there is a brake tool from Snap-on. That is eight dollars and fifty cents. Hammers two dollars. Well, let me get the electrical tester before I bury it. Two dollar on that. Fourteen fifty on the long S wing. Uh, I forgot the Dewalt. No price on that yet. Nine dollars on the cord. Eight fifty on this big mother. Uh, this guy here is three dollars and fifty cents. Valve spring compressor seven dollars and fifty cents. Another tape measure, Fat Max. That's four bucks. Two fifty on the siding tool. Another hammer, dollar fifty. This guy is two bucks. Oh, forgot about those. Snap on uh, seven dollars and fifty cents on this little uh, 13 millimeter quarter inch driver, 75 cents. The Greenlee test tool, another one unpriced. I'm failing four dollars on the uh, proto pliers, dollar on these guys. One of them's a scribe, one of them is a uh, doohickey to carry something or other. There we go, all perfect. Three dollars on the long um, grabber, two bucks on that guy, dollar on the adjustable number markers uh five bucks 650 on the miller's falls um little hand vise five dollars on the head strap magnifying light six dollars on the craftsman um oh, jesus christmas a saw fifteen dollars on the milwaukee rust guard 25 foot drain snake 750 on the pallet breaker upper 11.50 on the uh, quick fire burns a matic long chisel is three dollars and fifty cents the corner miter clamp saw guide corner set thingies 20 bucks harbor freight uh oscillating tool eight dollars another one eight dollars three inch cutoff tool from the harbor ten bucks uh most of these are actually i think all of these are a dollar or two dollars so we'll go through the more interesting one. We've got some knives there, dollar usually on those. 
Nipex nippers, those are $5.50. Hole punch, $3. Another one I gotta figure out. Um, we'll go back to those. Klein, $14.50. Klein, $9, $10 on the Wiggy. The insulated screwdrivers from GB, 1,000 volt, $2 each. Stanley Defiant um, Vice, $22.50. Shoemaker's uh, Hammer Do-It-All Gizmo, nine bucks, fifteen dollars on the big ass channel locks, four fifty on the uh, snap ring pliers, big ass cutters, eight dollars and fifty cents, and these guys, there's some Pexto in there I just saw, five fifty on these wire strippers, two dollars on the um, crescents, dollar fifty on those guys, five dollars on the Stanley side cutters. There's a grub hoe which is seventeen dollars and fifty cents, and then there's this assortment of other stuff. I mean. I don't know if I don't have it, it they don't they don't make it I guess. Uh, anyways, this has gone on long enough. Again, Wednesday through Saturday, one two five, and uh, all the info on the website. Thanks a lot. We'll see you soon.